On our travel to Cambodia in 2019, we also visited the Artisan's Angkor Silk Farm, winner of several UNESCO awards near Siem Reap. Artisan's Angkor is known as one of the finest silk producers in Cambodia. In total, the company employs more than 1,300 people training the traditional Khmer craftsmanship. Only the Angkor Silk Farm is open to the public. Admission is free, but donations are welcome and expected. Everything begins with the mulberry trees, because the silkworms love eating the mulberry leaves. The silkworms are fed with the leaves four times a day. When the worms turn yellow, they start to produce their cocoons. To prevent the worms from breaking their cocoon, the silk shell, they are put under the sun to dry them. The worms die and the cocoon can be turned into silk threads. The cocoons are put into pots with hot water and the women pull the fine and thin silk threads from the cocoons, thinner than a human hair. The raw silk threads are reeled. To get 250 grams of silk, about 3,000 cocoons are needed. The threads are washed and dyed with natural substances. The tools and machines are simple and old. The silk products are almost 100% handcrafted. Artisans Angkor is a social business employing mainly young people from Siem Reap and the villages around, giving them fair wages, medical insurance and other benefits. Then the threads are made ready for further processing using the old art of the e-cut technique. The e-cut weaving technique is one of the most ancient weaving techniques in the world. The artisan creates a tight knot resistant to dyes which forms an original pattern with the complex intertwining of the warp thread and the weft thread. This woman creates some kind of an analog computer which creates the pattern on the hand loom later on. The silk threads are then tied up to a frame. The warp chain will individually pass through the dents of the reed to be rolled up again on the cylinder placed in front of the loom. In the meantime, the weaver alternately paddle up and down on the levers to overhang the frame and to provide the route for the shuttle that carries the weft threads to move from right to left. After each passage of the shuttle, the reed will join and tighten the threads together to make the full fabric. A wonderful and fine product has been created. From the mulberry trees and the leaves feeding the silkworms, From the cocoons to the raw silk and the hard work of weaving the silk.
Artisans Encore presents the final products in a shop nearby and of course it's worth buying. Thank you.